A brand new report out tonight says there is a lot of work to be done, but not enough money to pay for it when it comes to fix fixing Michigan's roads. Just this morning, a huge pothole opened up here on I-275 right near I-96, and it blew out tires on about 10 cars. And that's just one example of what persists for drivers here in our state. Coco McAvoy is live tonight. And Coco, even with the huge bump in road funding, this report says it just isn't enough money. Yes, Kimberly and Devin, even with the extra funding, things like the gas tax increase and the hike in registration fees, the report says it's not enough that we still need a lot more money to fix these roads, $3.3 billion to be exact. And the report says a lot of that money needs to come to the city. Have we considered alternative materials? <laughs> Plastic or <laughs> something that doesn't just crumble? <laughs> Many of us joke about how bad Michigan roads are, but a new report from TRIP says they're going to get even worse over the next few years. While we made a down payment uh, two years ago uh, on our infrastructure, uh, it really uh, requires further investment. Because uh, the State Department of Transportation says that currently 20% of its major Roads and highways have pavement in poor condition, and they expect that to increase to 46% by 2020. Rocky Moretti with TRIP says it's partly because of growth in the state. It, it's a reflection of the economic growth and the returning vibrancy to the state, but it also means additional wear and tear on the state's roads and bridges. The report says we need to put a lot more money into our roads and $2 billion towards Detroit roads alone. Resident Franklin Speed agrees. They're building up these buildings down here, so just put some of that money towards the streets. The Michigan Department of Transportation released a statement in response to fixing Detroit roads, saying, quote, we are not delaying projects, but there are many projects we've identified on our system statewide. We don't yet have the resources we need to address them. Until they do, officials with TRIP say they will keep talking about our crumbling roads. And the report lists a number of roads in the Detroit area that need to be addressed. We'll put a full list and the full report on our website. Click on Detroit.com. Reporting live this afternoon, I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4.